Welcome to Antalya. Today I'm checking out the old city. So first we pass through Hadrian's Gate. Look how you can see these grooves from carts. Even in this old Spolia column you can see them. Just like in Pompeii. As you can see this is below the level of the rest of the city. As it's risen over the centuries. This neighborhood is called Kaleichi, which means in the castle, as it is inside the old city walls. Such incredible Ottoman architecture. Incredible how close together these buildings come up there. Antalya is Turkey's fifth most populous city and the fourth most visited city in the entire world, behind only Istanbul, London and Dubai, which is pretty impressive. Such a vibrant place. This place is reminding me of Kumalakazik, the old medieval Ottoman village, link in the description. Except this is like a well-kept city version of the same thing. Some kind of archaeology. Hmm. Very cool. This city was founded by the Attalid dynasty of the Pergamon kings. It was founded as Atalea, which eventually evolved into Antalya. It's not related to the word Anatolia, which surprised me. Just got a section of old Roman city wall here in this little park. Look at these vibrant buildings. Ancient vaulted ceiling here on the side of the road. Nice. We've got a large mosque up here. There's the Antalya Time Castle, or Clock Tower, as some might call it. Sat Kulisi. Very nice clock tower. So clearly some of these walls have been demolished to open up the city a bit. That's cool. I'm glad they left the towers at least. Very, very nice minaret there. So many beautiful Ottoman style buildings mixed in with ancient relics. A lot of Ephesus beer there. These streets are such a pleasure to walk around. Just so nice. Not many cars. It's nice and quiet, nice and breezy and open. 
so many historical buildings everywhere. It's just a beautiful contiguous urban texture. Surreal. I just love the multiple colors of these buildings. It's all so vibrant and beautiful. So full of culture. Very nice. After the abandoned mushroom hotel, I was getting used to seeing these weird animals around. the ancient port down there which centered around the Christian quarter. This city used to be divided into four quarters the Christian quarter, the Muslim quarter, the Jewish quarter and the Greek quarter. Now, I guess the Greeks were also Christians but I'm not exactly sure how that worked but they were all walled off from each other and then there was a big wall around all of it. You can see the city stretching down the coastline giant sprawling mid-rise but this section of the city is up on a cliff. Much more defensible. What a beautiful ancient street this is. Never mind all these gleaming new cars. I'm talking about this giant ancient wall and all this foliage behind them. How amazing is that? I simply love these overhanging floors. They're so characteristic of the Ottoman style. Merhaba, Australia. Welcome, friends. What's your name? Tim. Tim Arif, my name is my friend Arif. in Melbourne. Yes, from Mahlouk. Right. Oh, this one, this, kind of stone. this one. Right. I make this side. Very nice. All over, a little bit brown, and then, and this green a little bit. All different, white, this one, all different stone. Alabaster, this one, here, another. Mm -hmm. All, I am, make, I am long time here. Mm -hmm. 23 years. When right. I make here, like this one. These are Athena. Owl, yes. owl. Owl is clever and good luck. Mm -hmm. luck. Turtle, long life. Long life. Anyone bring money. One, uh, Artemis from mm -hmm. from Ephesus. Artemis, and yes. Maria also. Hermes, this Roman time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All Turkish, Turkish history. Sultan Ahmed, yes? Yes, Sultan Ahmed, yes. This one and another one more. Yes, up there. Mm. Very nice. A lot of nice things here. Small one. Mm, okay. How much? Today, first customer. Normal. I am selling uh, another people. Uh, 950 I am selling for you. 500, okay. And name the writing. 500 lira yes. for that? Yeah. Okay, okay. Name you, writing. Uh, name. Yeah, okay. You can write. Mm. Very nice. <laughs> Very nice. Nice stone back natural. Mm. Look. See you next time. Okay. Bye bye. Okay, bye bye.
sponge pub. I want to try to find a barber shop. I need a haircut. Top secret bazaar. Some kind of shopping district down here. Madrasa built in twelve fifty. Wow, very old. Here we go. Barber pole. Huh. Kind of Freemasonic barber logo there. Merhaba. Nice. Feeling fresh now. How's it look? My beard shouldn't be getting in the shot when I have it in the bite mount so much anymore. That's good. Now, time to find some lunch. It's Friday, so the pre-Friday prayers recitation has started. That's not the Azan. This is a very nice historical minaret up here. Let's take a look inside. Am I the only 
only person in here. You may notice that the prayer rugs are not aligned with the building. That's because this building is a second century Roman temple that was then a church and later, after the Muslim conquests, converted into a mosque. So it's not pointing towards Mecca. I had to align the prayer carpets a different direction to do that. That's always a hallmark of a converted mosque. Seriously ancient building though, from the second century AD. What an incredible lunch. Look at this. Beef ballet. So good. This incredible old city just keeps going on and on. It's just amazing. That beef ballet was just delicious. Now to find a good overview. There's a park nearby. I like the angles on these overhanging floors. Very cool. Hey, pretty cool doors. I like that. Here we have some very ancient looking section of wall with lots of nice spolia in it. Very, very cool. Here's where I went for dinner last night. Coco Rech, very good. This building almost looks abandoned. It's got smashed out windows. Oh geez, see? This place is so labyrinthine, I've already come back around to the surreal China. when it's done. Check out that ancient tower. So cool. Wow, what a city. I'm gonna leave it here. See you on the next one.